Hi, I'm Krista Crabtree. I'm the Ski Test Director for OnTheSnow.com, and I'm here to tell you about the 2013 Editor's Picks. If a day of skiing equals one big adventure to you, then look no further than the all-mountain category. These skis are made to ski the whole mountain. They have new shapes, often rocker technology and high-end construction. They're versatile and easy to use, and they have waist widths that range between 84 millimeters and 98 under the foot. Our first ski in the category is the Nordica Wild Bell. The Wild Bell has an 84 millimeter waist. It's designed to rip up the front side, but it's wide enough to ski some soft snow or variable conditions. It has Nordica's Wii core in it, so it has lightweight stringers to lighten it up. But all in all, this is a carve happy ski that can handle the whole mountain. The Vocal Kenja, this is 87 millimeters under the foot, and our testers said that this is a versatile one ski quiver. It has new tip rocker that Vocal added this year, and it also has Vocal's women-specific biologic, which is technology that's designed to reduce stress. So all in all, this is a versatile, light, responsive ski that's good for the whole mountain. The Kessley FX94. This is a game on ski. It has a race construction, it has full camber, and our testers say that this is for the aggressive woman that likes to rip up the whole mountain. It has a Holotech technology which hollows out pieces of the tip and the tail to lighten it up. But all in all, this is an aggressive, stiff ski for strong skiers. The Blizzard Samba. This ski is 98 millimeters under the foot, and our testers say this ski really excels in big GS turns. It's stable, and it has Blizzard's flip core technology where they put rocker in the tip and tail in the molding process rather than bending it in after. So all in all, this is a strong ski for big people who love making big turns all over the mountain. And lastly, we have the Fisher Koa 98. This is an all-mountain twin tip. It's designed to conquer crud and variable snow. It has a long rocker tip that can float on all kinds of snow conditions and a sandwich sidewall construction so it can still carve up the groomers. So all in all, this is for a ski for people who are skiing a lot of mixed snow conditions. For more in-depth reviews on these skis or any of the other skis we've tested, check out our online buyer's guide at onthesnow.com.